many students find it very difficult to convert one form of unit to the other. As per stats, 30% of students miss grade 9 in GCSE because of unit conversion. In this video, let's have a quick look at how, effect, how effectively we can convert the units. Right. These are all the standard units which usually you come across. Mass, length, time, current and the units are kilogram, meter, second, amperes. And the last one is really important, magnetic flux density. How do we measure magnetic flux density? Using the unit test law. Right. Usually, how do we convert? If it is a bigger unit to smaller unit, you need to multiply. If it is smaller unit to bigger unit, you need to divide. Just keep this simple two rules. This will help you to get grade 9. Let's keep going. I am going to take magnetic flux density. So, unit to measure magnetic flux density is Tesla. Right. How do we convert Tesla to milli Tesla and to micro Tesla and other way around? That is what, what I am going to showcase to you. Right. Tesla, Tesla is a bigger unit, milli Tesla is a smaller unit. Right. So, how do I convert Tesla to milli Tesla? Remember, if you want to convert bigger unit to smaller unit, you multiply by 1000 here. So, 1 Tesla equal to 1 times 1000 milli Tesla, that is nothing but 1000 milli Tesla. So, 1 Tesla equal to 1000 milli Tesla. Right. Then, how do we convert milli Tesla to Tesla? Remember, milli Tesla is a smaller unit. How do we convert smaller unit to bigger unit? Right. So, when you convert smaller unit to bigger unit, you need to divide by 1000. Milli Tesla to Tesla, divide by 1000. Right. Take a simple example. 1 milli Tesla is equal to 1 divided by 1000 Tesla that can also be represented 1 times 10 to the power minus 3. So, that is the usual standard way to represent. Now, we you were able to convert Tesla to milli Tesla and milli Tesla to Tesla other way around. Now, let us do one more step ahead. How do I convert? Tesla to micro Tesla, right? Now we are going to jump twice. First, we are going to identify Tesla to milli Tesla, which we have learned, and then we are going to learn how to convert milli Tesla to micro Tesla. So, twice. First, Tesla to milli Tesla, which we have already learned, we need to multiply by 1000, and then again milli Tesla to micro Tesla, again we need to times by 1000. So, that means 1 Tesla is equal to 1000 times another 1000 micro Tesla. So, that is nothing but 1 Tesla equal to 10 to the power 6 micro Tesla. Remember, if you want to convert bigger unit to smaller unit, you need to multiply. So, this is Tesla to micro Tesla. Now, let us do it other way around. How do I convert micro Tesla to Tesla? Right. To convert, let us try to understand how do I convert micro Tesla to milli Tesla? You need to divide by 1000. And how do I convert milli Tesla to Tesla? Again divide by 1000. Super easy. Right. Let us do it. So, one micro Tesla, if I need to convert one micro Tesla to milli Tesla, divide by 1000. And further, I need to convert milli Tesla to Tesla, divide by 1000. So, in a nutshell, 1 divided by 1000 times 1000, that is nothing but 1 times 10 to the power minus 6 Tesla. So, 1 micro Tesla is equal to 1 times 10 to the power minus 6 Tesla. So, in a nutshell, what we have learned, if you want to convert bigger unit to smaller unit, we multiply. If you want to convert smaller unit to bigger unit, you divide. If you are jumping one level, let us say in this case Tesla to milli Tesla, and then milli Tesla to micro Tesla. 